Hey everyone, here's how to quickly add a person outline for your effects in Spark AR. To start off, let's add in a rectangle. Rename it to person and on the inspector panel, click fill width and fill height. Next, select the camera on the scene panel and then on the right, click on the plus sign to add in the texture extraction for the camera. In the meantime, let's also add in two person segmentation masks that we will use later. I'm just going to rename the segmentation textures to make it seem more clear which is which. Let's name this the first one and the second one for the outline. Back to the rectangle, create a new material. Let's name this person matte and change the shader type to flat. For its texture, use the camera and on the alpha settings, use the first person segmentation. And now you can see it separated the person texture in the camera. To add the outline, let's create another rectangle. We can also just duplicate the one we already have, but rename it to outline. Let's move this above the person so that it will render before the person rectangle. Now change the material to a new one and rename it to outline mat. Same as before, change the shader type to flat and assign the alpha to the second segmentation. You can change the color here or insert your own image. You now have the outline but you can change the edge smoothness and overall thickness by going to the second segmentation mask and increasing the mask size. If you are not adding a background, another thing you can do is to adjust the mask size of the first person segmentation so that you can make the outline with some spacing in between. However, if you do plan to add a background, then you will just need to add more segmentation using the same steps when we created the outline. You can also play around with the blend modes. For example, if you change it to add, then you get this neon look of effect. If you have any questions or feedback, comment down below. And if you found this helpful, make sure to hit the thumbs up and subscribe for more Spark AR tutorials. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.